Okay, I've gone ahead, wet sanded the hood, started with an aggressive 800, worked my way up to 1500. Thought I had 2500, but I don't, so it's going to take a little more to buff out, but that's fine. I uh, was able to get the bugs out, small pieces of dust and dirt. Now, I've gone around the edge here, and I've uh, put tape. The reason being is that way, when I hit it with my buffer, I don't burn through the edges here. And the other thing is, when I buff, I'm going to try to keep going this way not towards it because uh, last thing I want to do is rip the paint on a fresh rip the edge on fresh paint so keep it this way that way if I hit the tape it's not a big deal so on the ends here the paint gets thinner believe it or not as you paint some of it's got around the corner same thing with the insides I left that in there that way I can buff it in and not blow through uh, right now I can't find my good buffer so I'm gonna use my backup and I'm gonna try some new cream and see what happens hopefully uh Everything goes well and I don't screw this up. Next time you see it, it'll have a pretty good shine. All right, gone ahead, finished the buffing, put some hand glaze on there. I got a couple light scratches. I just went over it with a rag and uh, gave it some. But that's not a big deal. I don't even think they'll show up outside. But uh, basically, that's how it came out. Got that there just so you can see what's going on. That's the hood, what you're looking at there, all of that. It's actually all that plastic up there. As you can see, it's got a good reflection to it. Came out clean. I'm happy it took a lot of work to get to this point, but learned my lesson. I'll, I mean, I don't mind trying new stuff because you never know, something could be good, but uh, when the system works, you just stay with it. And um, therefore, I tried something new. I didn't like it. Went back to the stuff that I... Uh, like to use and it worked out well for me so I'm happy all right hopefully uh, when I flip this hood over you didn't get all scratch from moving it around inside that um the stand there and if that's good it's not scratched all I gotta do is put it in a nice safe place and not worry about getting scratched and now I can get on to the other stuff such as um fenders and maybe the doors